Well, tonight, for the first time in American history, a black woman sits on the United States Supreme Court. As Natalie Brand reports, Justice Ketanji Brown Jackson made history this afternoon by being sworn in as the country's 116th justice. I, Katanji Brown Jackson, do solemnly swear. It's a ceremony that makes history as Justice Katanji Brown Jackson becomes the first black woman to sit on the nation's highest court. So help me God. Her official swearing in comes as Justice Stephen Breyer retires following the current term's close, nearly three months since her Senate confirmation. In my family, it took just one generation to go from segregation to the Supreme Court of the United States. While Justice Jackson will not change the ideological makeup of the 6-3 conservative-leaning court, Dean of Howard University School of Law Danielle Holly Walker says she will have a significant impact with her background and experience as a woman of color, a mother, and former federal public defender. I think Justice Jackson will be similar to other justices have, who have been labeled as kind of the conscience of the Supreme Court. And when I say the conscience of the court, I mean someone who really talks about the everyday person. Justice Jackson steps into the role after a highly contentious term that's divided justices on issues including abortion, climate change, and religion. This term has been probably one of the most heavily controversial, politicized terms ever in the history of the court, and we can expect more of that to come. I am pleased to welcome Justice Jackson to the court and to our common calling. In its next term, the court is expected to decide on more contentious issues, including voting rights, LGBTQ rights, and affirmative action. Natalie Brand, CBS News, The Supreme Court.